Welcome to this video tutorial brought to you by EnvisionCAD. In this tutorial we'll be taking a look at working with 3D solids and text and one workflow for placing text onto a 3D solid. Here we have our MicroStation 3D file with our solid and this is the text that we want to make it appear as though it's actually placed on or painted onto the cylinder. First thing we're going to do is take that text and drop it. By dropping the text we actually it becomes a complex shape and then now that it's a complex shape we can actually work with it a little bit more with a 3D solid. Going to the solids modeling tool set we're going to cut the solid. We're going to cut it in both directions and we're going to define a distance so it only goes a little bit into the solid. We're going to split the solid and there's no need to keep the profile or the letters so we're going to get rid of those when we're done. First thing it's asking me to do is select the solid and then the next thing I need to do is start selecting the profiles that I'll be cutting. I'm holding down the control key so I can make multiple selections here. Once I've made my selections I can accept it and then what it's doing is punching into the solid and uh, cutting those letters out for me. If I zoom in here and maybe set the uh, display to uh, transparent you can actually see how the letters are actually punched or cut out of that solid a little bit. So now what I'm going to do is just to help illustrate it further, I'm going to take each one of those cutout solids, create a selection set out of them quickly, and then change its color so that maybe I can apply a material to it. And there you go. Now the letters have been cut into the solid to make it appear as though they're actually right on top of the solid. This concludes our tip of working with solids and text. For more tutorials, please visit our website, envisioncad.com. Thanks for watching.